How do you do, partners? This week I'm taking a dive straight through the center of the earth and popping out in Japan, where if I don't get distracted by Pokemon or use schoolgirl panty vending machines, I'll be taking a look at the weirdest mobile games that I can rustle up in the land of the rising sun. First on my list is Survive Mola Mola, which was actually directly recommended to me as strange and different and wonderful uh, by Armin Ibrizajic, to whom I profusely apologize for the pronunciation. He works at Coffee Stain Studios, you know, the, um, the goat simulator guys. <laughs> For those who don't know, Mola Mola is the scientific name for sunfish, which in all languages besides English is known as the moonfish. What do you mean? No, seriously. I, I mean, take Dutch, we got Manvis. In German, Mondfish. In French, uh, Poisson Lune. In Portuguese, Peixe Lua. In Spanish, Peixe Luna. In Catalan, we've got uh, Peixe Luna. Uh, in, in Italian, Peixe Luna. In all obviously, Moonish Fishish. What's the deal, Anglophones? Quit trolling first world anarchists and get to fixing your phonemes. Regardless of what celestial body you name them after, Mola Molas are big ol' puppies. On average, adults weigh in at between 247 and 1,000 kilograms. That's from 545 to 2,205 pounds to anyone still tragically using Imperial. As such, it's only logical that Survive Mola Mola's game mechanic revolves around fattening up your fishy to be as massive as possible. Tragically, your aquatic buddy is prone to accident. If it's not too much squid stuck in his throat, then it's getting beached and drying up on a lonely shore. There are so many ways to cause death. to claim your beloved Mola, but there's absolutely no way to level him up without taking certain risks. There are two ways to get your Mola to gain weight. The most evident is by munching the food that appears on the screen. At first, you'll only see teeny little brown bits, but as you gain XP, you'll be able to put it towards purchasing different types of scrumptious eats, up to and including a free-for-all lobster buffet. The other way of fattening up fishy is by adventuring. You'll get the chance to adventure once an hour, although you can speed this up either by forking over some of your well-earned real-life cash, or by watching ads. Each different adventure comes packaged with a concrete chance of dying, which you'll see cheerily displayed on the screen before you foolishly embark on it anyway. If you've paid your dues to Lady Luck, then you'll stick the landing and gain some weight. If not, prep yourself for the sweet embrace of hot death, and your Mola will start over as a baby. The brilliant thing about Survive Mola Mola is that it's just perfectly balanced. Every time you die, the chances of surviving whatever killed you increase just enough to keep you going back for more. The more XP you rack up, the more types of food and adventure you unlock, meaning evolution will come a lot faster the more you play. The goofy graphics, funky translated copy, and generally ridiculous premise are genuinely compelling, making this the one evolution game that's actually stuck for me. This, plus the fact that you not only get trophies for how big your guy gets, but also for the sheer variety of ways that you've successfully sent him to his doom. There are a bunch of full screen ads in Survive Mola Mola, but you know, you're playing a free game about evolving a fish to be fat. It's kind of dumb, and so are we. The devs have tapped right into that risk reward river that motivates our monkey brains, and for that, I will be happy to tolerate a few interstitials. Thanks for watching! Go ahead and grab Survive Mola Mola from those download links right here, or subscribe to my illustrious channel. Uh, just one more linguistic tip for you. Were you aware that the verb molar in Spanish means to be friggin' great? You may think I'm joking, but I know you're just jealous that there is literally a creature out there named Awesome Mick Awesome. Uh, you can tell me what else I should review by telling me in those uh, comments down below, or just come say hi, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, wherever. You choose. Choose.